What's going on, guys? This video was sent to me of Nova Rockefeller apparently being asked if she was a Christian. And she gets like so flustered and was just like, ah, I don't want to talk about that, guys. Okay. Uh, you can talk about whatever you feel. I would never be like the like a speech police and like, you got to talk about this. But damn, I would think that you guys, you including uh, Tom and Donald, have exploited the Lord so much to make money that asking or being, I guess, asked a question of are you team Jesus or not? I would think that. I don't know. That wouldn't be too harsh. Would be too hard for you to do, right? How crazy does that sound? If you are a Christian, are you afraid to tell people you're a Christian? For real? That's how you feel? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, it's bad enough you got Tom McDonald out here with Ben Shapiro out wild. Right? Ben Shapiro want to go and help people get fired because they said Jesus is king. And what Tom McDonald do? Put out a song with him called Facts. Ben Shapiro ain't never been about facts, but I digress. So you put out this song called Facts. All right. <laughs> ben Shapiro, and it sounds foolish. And then now you got Nova Rockefeller. I'm not even going to go off on a Rockefeller name. That's a whole different discussion. Now you got out here just going to act like Jesus don't exist. And then I think she had the nerve to say she'd rather talk about cheese or something along, along those lines. It was straight ridiculous, man. Hold on. Let me pull up this clip. See if I can pull it up for you guys, man. Hit the like button. Share the video as well. Uh, I will show the chat too as well so you guys can see in full. There you go. Um... That is what I wanted to play. That's what I wanted to name our gang, our girl gang, which is, oh, it's not over here anymore. Now okay, hold on. We'll wind it back a little bit. Previous game. No mm, you can. What the fuck does it mean, Lost in the Links? Hey, Intense. Nova. I don't know. Like, can we not take my stream to talking about religion? <laughs> it's not the kind of content. Man, she streamed for four hours and you couldn't answer if you were a Christian or not. That's what she just got to ask. Hey, are you a Christian? <sighs> Can we not talk about religion? My whole stream. Shorty, you streamed for four hours and 14 minutes. You, you couldn't give a second for the Lord. For real? He died for your sins. You, you can't give him a second. My second was too much. Whoa. Yo, fan, the disrespect of Jesus is, is insane. Ten, I want to make. I want to like scream things about hot dogs <laughs> and fucking make. See, and I, I don't want to make it seem like I'm just going hard, right? You got to talk about the Lord. Come on, come on. I ain't, I ain't that kind of guy. You'd rather talk about hot dogs? What in the little Nas X is going on right now? That's crazy. So you got the religious tattoos upside down, which signifies a lot of nastiness. And then when asked if you're Christian, you don't want to. That's damn near denouncing it. If you too good to just blatantly say that you're a Christian, you damn near denounced it in my eyes. That's the way I just seen it. That's the way I just seen it, fam. You damn near denounced it. That's what just happened. That's crazy. And how hard is it? To yes, I am a Christian. Come on, man. I'm not like super biblical. I'm in here with the Bible. Even I got one. I got a few in here. But I'm not on here. Hey, man, you going to do this? And nah. But if I see something demonic, I speak on it. If I see somebody attacking Jesus, I speak on it. And then if this is shown to me, stuff like this is shown to me, especially when I've known to see like these type of people within the music industry exploit 
the Lord, right? It's either exploit or attack. But then now you almost denouncing them. You can't just answer a simple question. What? We live in a different type, type of crazy world right now. This is, I'm at a loss for words. Whoa. Mildly dirty jokes, okay? I'm just, I'm different. Eh. I don't want to talk about serious things. Definitely not asking for the vegan cheese. I have some. Do you want some? What I learned, if you watched my previous video. That's what she said. That's what she'd rather talk about. I'm not even going to watch any more of this. No one, uh, the Tom McDonald, uh, aka the Eminem. Nah, let's call it the Tom McDonald uh, cartel. Tom McDonald is big enough to have his own cartel now. He was trying to get down with the Eminem cartel, begging for, you know, his acceptance and acknowledgement. But then eventually he was just like, all right, start my own cartel. Me and Adam Calhoun, we're going to get in the same shirt. We have struggle genders over here. No, we're rocking over. Right, you know what? Never mind. Never mind. You get my point. You get my point. So you rather talk about all that stuff than to just answer a simple question. Are you a follower of Jesus? To me, that's crazy. Now, I don't want to go too hard and even start throwing in the demonic stuff and say that that's what she's about. That cross is suspect, though. And I don't know if you wanted to reverse people's opinions when they do accuse you of the demonic stuff because of your tattoos and Maybe not run from a simple question of if you're a Christian, like, I don't know. Yes and, yes and no. Like, how, how is that so? Yes. Keep it moving. No. If that's what you should, keep it moving. Like, it's not rocket science. It is not rocket science at all. I want to start reading some of the audience comments, too, as well. I want to start including that. My videos and live streams is a lot more of the interaction from the audience and getting you guys' opinions. So let me read what you guys are saying. They have to ride the fence to garner the largest amount of Nomi followers. You on point. You on point. That's what I noticed is that people like me who are honest, excuse the chair noise if you guys hear it. People like me who are honest, right? We, I always say this too, that we have to go the organic route and not ride trends and waves and all that stuff people will like us one day and hate us the next subscribe one day unsub the first time that they disagree right but then that's what happens when you're you're honest you're not a sheep right no one is on one type of side of all scales of different types of opinions all the time that just sounds nuts that that sounds crazy it's going to be one thing that you disagree with that one thing at least right then based off how you react when you disagree it says a lot real talk but when it comes to a lot of these fence sitters i don't trust fence sitters man i definitely do not even in just like a personal day-to-day -day life right say uh if i have a friend right and then i'm beefing with somebody else even if you're both of our friends, if you play the fence that I'm going to stay out of it, I can't rock with you. Because what that tells me is that you have no principles. You have no morals. You don't have your own code. I've always been that friend that I will tell you if you're wrong. So if I had two friends that were beefing and one was wrong, I'm going to let them know. If they both wrong, I'm going to let them know. In fact, let's address this as soon as possible. Get that out the way. I can't rock with fence sitters. Now, when it comes to the content creation game of from a subscriber point, I don't think that really applies. Y'all can watch whatever y'all want. You want to watch somebody that don't like me? I don't care. I don't give a damn. Are you supporting me? Appreciate you. Appreciate you, my boy, Blue. My boy, Blue. <laughs> If you know what movie I'm quoting, put that in the comment section. There's going to be a few people that's OGs that know what movie. My boy, Blue. My boy. But yeah, I don't like uh, fence sitters. I, I really get uncomfortable whenever I see someone start to fence sit around me. It just um, We address from the subscriber point. Watch over that, whatever you want to watch. 
or from a like content creator space, if you play the fence around me, you made your decision. It ain't like them or me. It's right or wrong, adult or immature. You're not mature enough to not play the fence. Can't rock with you. They have to ride the fence to garner larger amount of normie followers here. Sheep. Straight sheep. See what else you guys are saying? She says it's a blink on her ne neck. Not a crook. So she said it was a sword on her neck. I pronouncing that wrong. On her neck. And not a cross. Nigga, please. Why she? All right. If that's the case, that's that's an odd tattoo to get facing down. Wouldn't it be more clear? If that was a sword. You see, can we get it on the screen? Where, where's her tattoo? I want to see. Uh, uh, let's see. Give me one second, guys. Let's see if I can get a close up. Uh, where is it at? This it right here? Nah, there's no way she's saying that's a sword. Let me see. I'm trying to see what is it on her arm. I can't remember the the placement. Give me two seconds. There's no way that's a sword. Where is it at her neck? Nope. See what you guys are saying. Um, it's showing me one tattoo. I was gonna put it on the screen, but I'm not sure this is the one I'm talking about in particular. You show me all different types of cross tattoos. But yeah. I uh don't think it's a sword. I would have to I'm gonna get back to you guys on that. Let me get back to you guys on that. I wanna actually look a little bit um Closer into that. Is it right here? Yeah, nah, everything's blurry. Give me, give me about a day. So next time I'll, I'll update, I'll cover it. And then we'll clarify which tattoo, which one it is. So I'm getting different ones. Getting different ones. Um, But yeah, I will update you guys. She did hit down and right. And a sensor of the neck, so that okay, so that is her right and sensor of the neck. It looks like she No, that's not it. Oh no, I'm still trying to find it, guys. Is that it? Nah. Okay. Found it. Took me a second. You'd be surprised how many damn <laughs> Cross tattoos pop up when you put Nova Rockefeller cross tattoos. It's like a whole page. Okay. I have to call me through a bunch of them. I found it. Uh, let's get a full screen going. See if we get that to work. Okay. Got to reload the page, guys. Uh, why is it not loading? Sorry, guys, bear with me. If you can. This thing is acting crazy wonky right now. Why is the screen not loading? Um, sorry, guys. Yeah, that was really odd. I think I fixed it, though. Sorry about that. <laughs> we had technical difficulties. That was weird. Um, but all right, I got it loaded. As you can see, that don't look like no damn sword, fam. That gotta be 
some of the biggest cap I ever heard in my life. That's that look crazy. That don't look like a sword, but maybe maybe I'm tripping. He said, you also have to consider context is not like she hasn't been seen with anything else. That's considered satanic and imagery. Yeah, nah, you right. She has. Yeah, as y'all laughing. <laughs> You're laughing at the technical difficulties? Yeah, I was definitely going through it over here. It's just me. It's just me. <laughs> Unlike Tom McDonald, who got a whole team of people talking about it's just him. No, nah, it's just me for real. And the fan gaining you guys, of course, you know what I mean? But yes, this looked like a... It looked like a, a upside-down cross. This don't look like no damn sword. Right? Like... Yeah, nah, that seems odd. Especially, look at the... The rest of the stuff on her neck. Is that the um the drink that was supposed to be wrapped around no it looked like the looked like it could be barbed wire, but it also could be a thing that was wrapped around uh Jesus' head when he was on the cross too as well. Yeah, that's pretty suspect. I ain't going front. That's suspect as hell. Never really bothered to try to see it better, but that was what she said. Yeah, nah, that was like a upside down uh cross to me. She did hit down, it's right in the center, I found it. I found it, appreciate you. Yeah, that was a response. Crazy. Uh, Bob Wire, I think. All right, cool beans, that's what I figured at first. But either way, it's, it's hard to argue that it does, doesn't look like a, a upside down cross. I saw Jesus on my neck, also referenced the tats. Come on, bro. Come on. Now, people could say, oh, what is she talking about? Like a chain. I ain't never seen it with like a Jesus chain. Maybe I'm tripping. <laughs> Maybe I'm tripping. But yes, I agree. I would think that her song, Jesus on my neck, would reference that. That's what I thought the whole time. That's what I thought the whole time. <laughs> That's crazy. Wow. Yeah, it's, just, it's so in your face, bro. I swear, when it comes to Tom McDonald, I think that him and his old team be playing and stuff like this. But they can laugh at the audience. Like, look at them. They don't even realize. They don't even realize. Straight nasty. Mm -mm -mm. But either way, I think Tom would tell and the Lord knows what's real. Tell me what you guys think down in the comment section. Hit the like button.